This episode was brought to you by Display. I'm dressed up today because we have the most important tier list we've made yet. We are going to be ranking bottled water. Water is not created equal. I don't care what kind of fucking propaganda you're digesting you need to accept right now. Not all water is the same. And today we're going to be tackling this very passionate field by giving you the facts, scientific facts on what is the best and what is the worst bottled water. So left to right, Poland Springs origin. I've never even heard of this before, so this will be a I've nice surprise. I've seen Poland Springs, but I've never tried it. Do you, do you want us to move these or keep them here? Yeah, move them. Okay. All right. Okay. So do you know anything about it? Like I know nothing about it. Where is it from? Does it say? Oh, refreshingly Maine. Well, I would imagine Poland. Well, it says Maine on the back. Is there a Poland in Maine, perhaps? I don't. I don't think so. Does it say anything down here? Cedar Springs, Dallas, Maine. I bet you Maine is Dallas, like, has a large Polish population. Uh, maybe. Oh, I almost just drank right out of the bottle. Give it a Sorry. Smell. <laughs> yeah. All right, I guess we should smell it once we pour. Yes, yeah, sweet. pretty sweet aroma, a bit playful on the senses. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, you have to aerate. Yeah, of course. Can you tell what year it is yet? Not yet, but it is vintage. This Aged is... in a wood bottle keg, excuse me. It's cask aged. Cask. Oh, that's what it's got. Before. This might just be the glasses, but it's got a rosy hue to it. A bit, yeah. It might be my hands just reflecting through it. No, no, it's probably a rosy hue. Yeah, it's a rosy hue. I'd say it's a... Maybe a 72. Ooh. Yeah. I didn't coat all the taste buds. You gotta cough it. Yeah, that's when it really brings out the latent flavors. Well, I gotta tell you, Matthew, the Polish know what they're doing with their springs. I'm, I'm shocked. I don't know why it's in Maine, but I'm shocked with how great this is. Are you getting a hint of chlorine as well, or just me? That's some chlorine coming out. A little bit. Yeah. Is that arsenic? <laughs> <laughs> You know, I'm pretty picky when it comes to water, Yeah. and I'm not offended by that. No, that, that one's not very insulting, to be Good honest. Good mouthfeel felt like water. It did. It had a very watery feel yeah. to it. It wasn't much of a taste, which is great. Mm -hmm. Not salty, none of that. Easy. No carbonation either. A smooth opening, which yeah. I can always appreciate. That was that really, water. really nice. Yeah, there's none of that. Psst. Yeah, no. Okay. This was a bit of an underdog water bottle for me. I'd never heard of this brand before, and I gotta tell you, I walked away pleasantly surprised. It wasn't insulting, even a bit playful at times on the palate. I really appreciated the Poland Springs water, so I feel comfortable slapping Poland Springs at the A tier, just like I feel comfortable using Displate. Now, I'd like to talk to you about Displate. I've mentioned them before, but I really am a huge fan of their product. I just recently, as I mentioned last time, got a wonderful metal vaginal art piece that looks like Van Gogh, so a nice vagina Van Gogh piece that I've recently mounted next to the TV in my room. Just so that way I'm always looking at high quality art when I'm watching TV. And they, I really can't stress enough just how high quality the products are. It mounted in seconds. It took me literally like five seconds to mount and it hasn't moved an inch in the entire time it's been there. I even threw a dildo at it to try and suction cup it to the vagina because I thought it'd be cool to complement the piece. Not only did it suction cup, but it didn't move the piece at all. It didn't dent it or damage it. It really is just some very fine, high quality material. And I just really like Displate, and I've talked about them quite a bit. They're really easy to mount. There's a wide selection of things you can choose from, custom options as well. I'm just a big fan of the product, so if you're interested in trying Displate for yourself, you can click the link in the description below to get 30% off for two weeks and then 15% off after that. And that's just clicking the link in the description to get 30% off a Displate for two weeks and then 15% off afterwards. All right, let's go on to a shitty one. Oh, well, boy. Uh, no bias. Wait, keep it quiet when you open it. Let them hear the pss Oh. <laughs> that's bad. A little wet fart from your water, you hate to hear it. Advertising. Oh. oh, that was a lot. Oh man, she's she's queefing hard today. Jeez. Yeah, they're advertising Venmo on the bottle. Mm. Who makes this? Is this Pepsi? That's Pepsi. Oh, fuck. Yeah. Thank you. This is an insult to water. Oh, there's bubbles in my water. Come on now. Yeah, that's carbonated. Yeah, you, you, know, you don't like to see I this. I pay extra for the carbonated water. 
Oof. It doesn't even have a good spin to it. I can't I'm even sure, air rate. See, look through mine. You can see all those oh, little things. They're little... definitely going to say that's minerals, but I don't think so. That's no, like that's backwash from the from the workers. Yeah, it's a little bacteria Oof. in there. Here, let me get a let me get a it small. It's like you just drank out of a cup. <laughs> no, that's not it. No, 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 that couldn't. It doesn't make any sense. Just knock it off. All right. Oh, it's very heavy. It's like mm -hmm. steel in your mouth. Ugh. Why? Ugh, it's not smooth. And I... It's not even that it just has a flavor. It's a bad flavor. Yeah, it's a yucky flavor. Is it Dasani or Aquafina that was banned in the UK? Do you remember? Probably both. Yeah. Yeah, I don't know, actually. But that's not good water. No, I'd rather drink out of the ocean. I'd rather drink out of the bathtub. The bathtub's clean water. Might as well just drink out of the toilet at this point. I think that's what we're doing. This is pretty gross. They just have their chief officer spit into each bottle. Just give it a little, nice little touch. Yeah. yeah, that's where the minerals come from. It's not even refreshing. It's making me thirsty. I was going to say, I, I don't know if you were joking or not, but I feel like it dries out my mouth mm -hmm. when I take a sip. And I'm not even, I'm not kidding. It's just a very weird it's a, feeling. It's, it's yucky. I don't know. what. Where are they, where are they sourcing this water from? The hell. Is that or? No, no, that's just the word or, not or. <laughs> <laughs> uh, they, see, they're not even proud of where they get this water. Yeah. They don't even say what spring it comes from. Definitely just tap water from yep. one of the sinks at Pepsi. <sighs> no doubt. In a surprise to absolutely no one, Aquafina is a hunk of shit and is just not good water. I don't think I've ever met someone in my life. I've never met like some kind of maniac madman that said they like Aquafina. I don't know if even such a thing exists or really could exist. The human body is hard-coded to reject the taste of Aquafina. It's abhorrent. It is just some very bad water. The only compliment you can give it is that if you're dying of thirst, it might save your life, but at what cost? It's really not good. I don't know who's drinking it. I've never had an experience where someone's like, Hey, I'm going to go get some water from this aisle over here. And they walk back with Aquafina. Like the only time you'll ever see someone reluctantly taking Aquafina off the shelves is during like a hurricane event where it's a crisis and everyone's buying out all the water. But naturally they all leave the Aquafina because even during an emergency, no one really wants that. So Aquafina, it's a D tier. And let me tell you why it's not F. Because there's one devil even worse than Aquafina and you're going to see it on the list soon. Oh, all right. Yeah. All side. Fiji. Fiji's this like... This was the yeah. most expensive one. This is some bougie shit. Yeah. I remember hearing about Fiji water a long time ago. Earth's finest water and it's bottled at what source? Oh, in Fiji. Fiji. It's water. Fiji Islands. Well, it's even got a whole little fan fiction. Earth's finest water on a remote island over 1,600 miles from the nearest continent. Tropical rain slowly filters through volcanic rock into mm. a sustainable ancient artis artesian aquifer. Drop by... Drop, oh, drop by drop. Fiji water acquires natural minerals and electrolytes that give it its significant, soft, smooth taste. Perfected by nature, there's nothing on earth quite like it. Alright, that's... Am I gonna hear a hiss? Oh, oh wow. Good lord! Alright. I gotta work hard for Yeah, you things. gotta really try and... I'm listening. Get some elbow grease. That was probably yeah, just my bones that, breaking. Was, yeah, I think your knuckles cracked. We're good. No hiss. Alright. Nice After those claims, I'm I'm skeptical, but I'm excited. Matthew, look at how clear that water. The oh clear, I can God. see the. There's no rosy here. hue in that one. Oh my! Here, let me get some. It's like it's like my it's like my prescription on my eyes through this thing here. It's a Do you beautiful have a prescription. A, a slight one, yeah. <laughs> but this will probably cure that. That does look really nice. There's no Pepsi spit. Yep, nothing. No see, this, mineral bubbles. This, squashes Danny's claim that it was my own backwash. <laughs> that came from the bottle, not from me. Oh, that, that is smooth. That is smooth. Some pretty good one here. Cheers. Yeah, that'll hydrate you. That's, that's good water. That they made some bold claims, but I think Fiji They're backed them up. up. No wonder it was so expensive. Yeah, my God, I feel like it was hand delivered from Fiji. Yeah, this is incredible stuff, Danny. Have you ever had Fiji water? Uh, I'm not sure actually. Here, take, take Your a, skin looks dry. Yeah, take this a fix it. Take a swig. Yeah, take a little straight from the source. Right from really the source. Good. Yeah. 
Get the taste. You of can it. do whatever you want. I can't be mad after that sip. Shocking. That's pretty, yeah, pretty refreshing, yep. actually. Yeah. yeah. It's crisp. All of it's the what Aquafina left me hoping for was cured by Fiji's water. Yeah, the secret is the volcanic ash that, that runs into its minerals. minerals. Yeah. Now, I'd heard of Fiji before in the past, kind of as just like a meme for the kind of person that spends way too much on too little. You know, like, oh, I'm going to go to the store and get Fiji, and you get one bottle of water for a hundred bucks, and you're like, oh, shit, okay, this guy's real fucking, you know, crazy about his spending. But, you know, Fiji, it's good. Like, it, it lives up to that reputation of being, like, an expensive quality water. Fiji was really fucking good. I have no complaints about it. I think that is an easy S tier all day. Now, I've never heard of this before. Evian made by the French Alps. Now, let's see where it's bottled. Yeah, I love the design of the bottle. It is. It looks like a cracked egg. It's supposed to be mountains, but I really like the look of it. I think it's supposed to be glaciers. No. Oh. Well, no. actually, I don't even know why I'm saying that. It's an egg. Yeah, I don't know what glaciers look this like. This is egg water. Uh, now, the cool thing here is they show you the breakdown on the electrolytes and mineral composition. That is pretty cool. Yeah, I don't know if you're able to see that clearly, but... Well, I don't know if Danny's qualified to interpret these pH numbers. Yeah. yeah like, this is... What a balance. Do you have a PhD in chemistry, Danny? Yeah. Okay. Oh, well, then you're qualified to drink Evian. There's 360 bicarbonates, mm. 14 sulfates. That is double the normal sulfates. 15 silica. That's concerning. That is actually a lot of silica. <laughs> I don't know if I can put this on my body. <laughs> is this, it feels like a toxic amount of silica. 7.2 pH. I love the pH balance. Hopefully no carbonation. What are you? Uh, there we go. Childish Gambino. <laughs> Does he? That's, <laughs> that's a line from his song "Sweatpants" or uh, "Sweatshirt." No, I can't Something say sweaty. It's a good pour. Also pretty clear. Yeah, it's a. Uh, you know, you can tell the difference between this and Aquafina. Like, I just want to pull Aquafina back out. <laughs> Shame it again. Look how shitty it looks. Even in the bottle sucks. Yeah, I know. That is Sorry. gross. We're, we're, we're on heavy. That is a gross, that is a gross water. I wouldn't let my dogs drink Aquafina. That's like from a commercial where you see it running off the mountains. Yeah. Here, let's close that up. It does look like another high quality piece of water. You can really see the silica. Yeah, that's a lot of silica. I'm still concerned about that, but yeah. I think we'll be okay. Right. Have you been taking your vitamins? Yeah. Oh, well, we're fine. I might OD on this though. Ooh, she's got some character to her. Got a player like the harmonica. Mm -hmm. Oh, there it is. There, that brought it out. That's this what one, she was hiding. This one stumped me. Yeah, I don't know how to feel. It's not. It's no, it's no Fiji. Let's not mix words about that. It, no it makes me want to come out and say I love it, but something's holding me back in there. Yeah, just, I think it's just not as smooth. It's, it has to be the silica. Yeah, you know, it's not bad. I mean, you even get the chemical breakdown down here. Yeah, I, I don't even know why I can tell you that it's not the best, but it's not the best. Silica is what's coming in those little packets in department stores, right? Yeah. yeah. This tastes like a, a Dillard's. <laughs> <laughs> that was my first thought as well too it's i mean what's really selling me is that it's carbon neutral i mean so you can feel good while hydrating i don't hate it i also don't hate it i think that's a comfortable b tier water yeah i'd even be comfortable going b plus but yeah for jackson's sake we'll stick with b yeah teetering on a but yeah. i don't think it quite it's reaches right a. on that line Another newcomer to the water game. It was a pleasant surprise, a decent experience. I do say it was one of the better waters. It was teetering on the A tier, but I don't think it quite breached that threshold. I think B tier is right where it belongs. It's a very inoffensive, standard, decent quality water. Do you want Zephyr Hills now? Yeah. It's like, just to really yeah. cleanse the palate and get something that we know was built by the gods here? Yeah. I, I've lived off Zephyr Hills for 26 years. Anybody who says Zephyr Hills isn't the best is wrong. Like objectively wrong. Just and smooth pour. Didn't even look, hear anything. The best thing about this is they are confident. They know it. right off the bat you buy their bottle and they tell you they're not a trash water. That's exactly right. I'm not trash. I'm not trash. No siree. Not today, Dad. That's confidence. And it's from a natural Florida spring. Nothing says quality like Florida. Florida. No. 
Or the water. Mm. It's like a meal. A, a fine meal. Mm. Luxury diet mm. in a glass. <laughs> yeah. That's really good water. It'll get, it gets you hype. Mm. So you had to see me like that. Yeah, he's going pure primal. It, it brings it out of you. I want to slam the wine glass. I just here. don't get how they do it. I don't know either. It's that spring. So what? Uh, who, who searched for the fountain of youth? Was that a... George Washington? It wasn't George Washington. <laughs> who, who, who looked for the fountain of youth? It's like some... Nomad, yeah, some Ponce de Leon or I was something. Say Ponce de Leon. Um, I, I don't know. Bob Marley. You know who searched for the Fountain of Youth? I know. Crystal you know, yeah. Springs, Pasco County, Florida. Now I will tell you, it is Ponce de Leon. Yep. Oh, I thought I was right. Well, um, <laughs> <laughs> can you deny that Bob Marley searched for it? I will tell you, this is the only good thing to come out of Pasco, Florida. Yeah. But They're probably also the only thing to come out of Pasco, Florida alive. Sure, this is really you guys ever gone to Zephyr Hills? No. I've swam in Zephyr Hills. Really? I have, yeah. You take a little more. I don't think so. But Am I, I, I drinking Danny right now? So I might have. Actually. Yeah, uh, that's fair. It's cold. Well, I bet it is. Oh, this is just so good. It's chilled to perfection. Mm. Mm. Yeah, so that'll do it. We're going to have to save that for once we, did, we take a sip of Dasani. <laughs> Zephyr Hills, we both knew going in, S tier. Fucking grew up on Zephyr Hills. Zephyr Hills has never let me down. I've never had a bad experience with Zephyr Hills water. It is the most consistent, most refreshing, and just all around, like, best water there is, really, especially for its price. Zephyr Hills, baby, S tier, all day. I think, like, there's an objective. Bring out the Dasani. Get that, okay. get that naughty little bitch out here. All right. Now, first thing I want to let you know, it's going to be hard to hear on these mics, but it it's hard. Like, yeah. There's, there's room That's in there. Open. Yeah, but this is like, ugh, I could pop it. Listen yeah. to this part. Are you ready? No, get some earplugs. I hope they can. Oh, oh, oh. That's the sound of fear. Look at all those bubbles. It's just, it's like armored. Yeah, that's pretty bad. It's way too much plastic. It's just wasteful. Like, I'm not convinced I'm not drinking liquid plastic. Oh, and there's... You can see the backwash going up in there. Here, let's get a quick pour before we lose it. all of that. Yeah, I want to make sure I save that precious uh, regurgitated water. Now, is this Coke's response to Aquafina? I think it's also owned by Pepsi. Is it? I is could it? be wrong. What's Coke's parent company's name? Big Coke or something? Yeah, something like that. Yeah, the Coca-Cola Coca -Cola. company. Okay. Well, they both fucked up. Yeah. That's for sure. Let me just put this back between them. Oh. Now, interesting. The only two up here that I've seen have an expiration date on them. Mm. Aquafina, Dasani. That's interesting. I wonder why. Nobody else. Well, oh, nobody else's water goes bad. Dan, God, if you find one, you shut your mouth. Dasani is just disgusting. That one's worse than Aquafina. <clears throat> it really is. Yeah, just go ahead and get that out of your system, Matt. It's not worth it. It's painful. Oh. It's painful. September 3rd, 2022. That's revolting. For Fiji. No, that's the date they were born. <laughs> In the future. <laughs> <laughs> that is revolting water. It but really we is. have class. We have to finish it. It is repulsive water. It should be a crime to own a case of this in your home. You should be written off as a psychopath. It's really, really bad. really bad. It is. It is. If you were dying of thirst in the desert and someone offered you Dasani, you're better off just dying. This is also a plant bottle. What's that plant in Australia that makes you want to die? Gimpy Gimpy. Yeah, this yeah, is definitely gimpy, built gimpy. out of the Gimpy Gimpy plant. Yeah, absolutely. That's the kind of plant bottle that is. All right, let me... And there it is. The worst water mankind has accidentally made. Dasani is truly horrendous. Worse than Aquafina by a decent margin, I would argue. I wouldn't be surprised to learn Dasani is Latin for dog fecal juice because that's what it tastes like. The fucking Dasani tastes like if you took a McRib and shot it out of a car's exhaust and then liquefied it. It's terrible. Dasani is absolutely abhorrent. I don't know who drinks it uh, by choice. It's horrible. Dasani, absolute F tier. Smart water.
Never had that. So my favorite little Easter egg about smart water is when you look through the bottle, there's a fish on the inside of oh, the Oh! It's whoa. adorable, isn't it? What, is, what is that fish doing there, Danny? Take a peek at that bad Snuck boy. Snuck in there. Whoa! whoa. playful water. Yeah, yeah, reminds me of Pudge the Fish from Lilo and Stitch. Yeah, that is playful. It's so crispy. Wait, 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 wait. You wait, can wait. live in it. I'm seeing something here. I don't know what you got. On the Dasani bottle, you see that logo? I do see is that, that Coke? I know it's Coca-Cola. Is that their logo? I think so. Because on the back of this bottle, I've seen a very similar... No, it's ruined! Very similar. But this says it's made by Glossu. Oh, well, I do trust them for quality. Maybe... Oh, this is Sip and Scan. So maybe we're good. Maybe it has oh, nothing to do with Coca-Cola. What the fuck is Sip and Scan? I don't know. They're trying to get me to buy something else. <laughs> All right. And that's conspiracy theories on water bottles. It's all connected. Right, it's also vapor distilled water and electrolytes for taste. All My right. fucking throat hurts from Dasani. It is bad you water. You still have water in your glass, by the way. Oh, this is Zephyr Hills, right? Oh, good. Yeah. You're a lucky man. Yeah, Dasani, like, just like Aquafina, made me feel dehydrated. Yeah, like it actually makes my throat hurt. Get you a quick pour. Ooh, that is a nice pour. It's got a nice sound to it. It did have a good sound. Good decibels right there. I mean, it's quality water and minerals. I'm do a big aeration on this one. Mm. It's got a smell. Most water doesn't have a smell. It's got a taste too. Yeah, the last thing you want in your water is for it to taste. Yeah. I'm not convinced that logo doesn't mean Coca-Cola now. Yeah, I honestly think that's just Dasani if it was on meth. <laughs> this is meth Dasani? Yeah, it's like Dasani light. I think we might have to put meth in Dasani to compare. <laughs> <laughs> That'll solve it. Yeah, it's not good. Yeah, that is not good. I, I'm looking it up. I, I'm not convinced Coke doesn't make your smart water. Oh, here's where it comes in. What is it? You let listen, me know. Listen to this dog shit. We took inspiration from our puffy white friends, clouds, and created pure vapor distilled smart water, trademark, with a purely balanced pH. Then we one-upped nature and added electrolytes for a crisp, clean taste. Nobody one-up nature. You can't one-up one nature. nature. It's literally impossible. Now, let me, let me drop a bomb on you. Yeah. Glassu Smart Water is a brand owned, brand of bottled water owned by the Coca Cola company. I knew it, it's all connected. Can you say that first word again? Glassu, I took five years of French. Ambassadors include Jennifer Aniston and Gal Gadot. Oh my god, they're all in on it. Jesus, how deep does the corruption go, Matthew? It's, oh, I think it's based in Scientology. Honestly. I wouldn't be surprised if Bill Gates is behind that. It might be. And it, yeah, the garbage. Smart water, my ass. That's a D. It's a D because it's not as yeah. bad as Dasani or Aquafina. We could taste that it was a Coca-Cola water from the get-go. Yeah, Matt, sni bad. Matt sniffed out the truth. It was bad. Sick to my stomach. Never had smart water, never will again. Wasn't good. Not as bad as Aquafina or Dasani, but it's still D tier. And again, Aquafina, I don't think is as bad as Dasani either, which is why Dasani is alone in the F tier right now, even though Aquafina and Smart Water are both also absolute fucking garbage trash. It's just Dasani is so fucking bad, it needs to have a category all to itself as like the, like the absolute lowest point water could go. Like there's raw sewage, and then there's Dasani down here. Like it's that fucking bad. And Smart Water was somewhere above raw sewage. It's so D tier, I think, works. Now, this is the biggest wild card. Yeah, none of us have ever had this. It's core water. It one-ups Evian, which boasts a 7.2 pH balance. This one's sitting at the perfect pH, it says, of 7.4, which is your body's natural pH balance. That is interesting. Seven-stage purification, electrolytes and minerals for taste, and 100% recyclable, BPA-free. Really? I, I gotta say, the design of the bottle is pretty it's interesting. Nifty. It's like Cyberpunk 2077. Yeah, I like this. Oh. oh. I don't know what oh. that sound was. I don't know whether to hate oh, it or like it. Get a look at this goofiness in here. Look how, Whoa. Look at how wacky that gets. You could like pour yourself a shot from this with the water. That's probably what it's for. Wow. And look at the massive opening. You could definitely get big swigs. Yeah. Whoa, that's a that, wide mouth bottle. That is... <laughs> yeah. 
No. <laughs> Look at how she comes out so aggressive. It wants to be consumed. Yeah, and it wants to be consumed quickly. Oh, I'm coming in. Speed run. Well, it's got a taste. It tastes like ice. Burnt ice. I've never tasted my own pH before. <laughs> yeah, it's like looking into a mirror of yeah. my soul through my water. This is like human saline. Yeah. Well, it's not bad, but it does have a taste. Yeah, I don't... The taste isn't bad. I don't dislike it. It's the first water that's had a taste that I don't dislike. Yeah. Like, I don't wish the taste wasn't there. It gives me a little bit of that mouth feel that Dasani and Aquafina do, though, where you feel a little dry, but I'm not as upset with it. Yeah. I also don't know... I, I guess I can't dispute, but I don't know if my body's natural pH wants more of the same pH being put into yeah, it. Yeah, like, I kind of want to be unique. I don't, I don't want to drink that. Does it say where the spring is that they source this from? I think it's just humans. Did they just start dehydrating <laughs> corpses? I think I'm tasting memories. Plano, Texas. Plano, Texas. You know, that's where I would expect this to come from. Yeah. The heart of Texas. Yeah, I could taste the old country elements to it, of course. Yeah. I could actually feel myself wanting more gun rights as I took my swigs. Yep. And they made the, the mouth bigger, like they always say, everything's bigger, bigger in Texas. Texas. Yeah, that's a good, that's a good point. I mean, you could dump the whole bottle out, and it's like you went full inversion oh, it's here. it's perfect for a chugger. Yeah, the entire thing's just coming out all at once. Oh, don't let Badlands get his hands on this. Let me just... Oh, wow. Oh. That comes out quick. That's nuts. That comes at you fast. I'm going to go for it. Oh, boy. Matthew, you've gone insane. <laughs> I can't do it while laughing. I'm going to drown. Nobody's ever <laughs> chugged core. <laughs> <laughs> He's not powerful. It really enough. does come out much faster than you'd expect. Yeah, it's a full fl flash flood in there. Oof! I thought I was—I just saw my life flash before my eyes. That's what happens. People try to chug core, they die, and they become the next core water bottle. It's a cycle. Seven point four pH, my ass. Yeah, I can't dispute it, but it doesn't taste like my body. Like if I was to piss in my mouth, I'd probably say like, probably different pH. Yeah. Well, there's no urate. So that's what I was. That's what it's I. It's also missing on. the silica. Yeah, thank God. Thank God for that. <laughs> Core about as average, uh, wild, wacky as you could imagine for a water bottle, I suppose. I think C tier fits it best. It's not something you know overwhelmingly horrible. It's not that bad, and it's not that good either. It just it's right on that line of yeah, that was water, and that's good enough. And so, yeah, I think Core is going to sit comfortably in the C tier. So that's about it. These were the most popular waters that we could find at the gas station. So, yeah, I mean, that's about it. So, yeah.